get a Hoya. Hoya. Can I get a Hoya? Hoya. Can I get a Hoya? Hoya. Yeah. I'm sorry. I had to do it. I had to do it for Kevin. Um, just because he's he's my boy, Kevin Moon. Kevin and Nah, 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 nah. I love the boys. Obviously, that's why we're here. Um, we are gonna watch the Steeler MV that came out earlier tonight. Um, mm, I'm so excited. I'm so so excited. I watched. I was watching their um, their first concert, which is like. I I feel like online concerts are kind of strange. It's what we got to do right now. But the reason that I really wanted to watch their online concert and the reason I bought a ticket despite all the madness that went on there, uh, was because I had gotten an actual physical, like the real ticket for the real physical concert that was gonna happen right before, like right as COVID really like skyrocketed for the first time in Korea. Um, so I felt like I had to see it because it was like I was going to be there. So I had to see it and it was great and I enjoyed it despite all the, the setbacks that they had. The poor boys, they did amazing. Um, they looked amazing. And so they were really hyping up the comeback because this was on Saturday and today's Monday. So anyways, I'm gonna shut the hell up and I'm gonna watch it because it's gonna be, ooh, ooh, I'm so excited. I'm very, very excited. Oh my God. Okay, three, two, one, go. There we go. I love these colors. I loved the, oh, Shut the fuck up. <laughs> I love that so much from the teaser. This one is so hot too. Oh, oh. Hey, ah. Who? Who let, Jian's always been hot, but like, oh. Oh my fucking God, this comeback. This is so rude. Rude. <laughs> Oh, okay, Road to Kingdom shit. Oh, oh, the way they, what's that, stood up from the ground like that? <gasps> Rude. Oh my god. Hey. I love the sequin top. Oh my god. I love Eric too. Uh, oh, I've never been attracted to Hyunjae and that just changed my mind right there. Oh my god, y'all. Y'all, what the fuck? Yes. Hey, okay, center Jacob, we see you. Is Eric wearing a bucket hat? Oh my god. That's a beautiful shot of new, like... Holy shit. He looks like Eric has come back too. I'm confused. Oh, oh. Q in this jacket is just so good. Oh my god. Someone stop him. Kevin Moon, I would die for you. Oh my god. Hey. Oh, that's my baby. He looks so handsome. I love this color hair on Hagnyan, like for real. Also, who gave Sanyan the fucking right? <laughs> You're okay, Yonsei. I don't love the bucket hats, but oh, cute. I love this. Give us a dance break. Why does he look so hot? Oh, Young Hoon. Okay, baby. Oh, that just took my breath away. Is Q in a cage? Oh, I liked that light rising behind him. Oh, I have chills. Stop! Stop! Okay, he's rapping Jacob too? Hey! He looks snatched as fuck in that red outfit with the harness. Oh my god, those pants. Oh! Ah! Holy fuck. Holy fuck. Oh my god. 
I just love the colors in this video too. Oh my God, stop this. Oh, that was fucking cool. Oh, what an ending. Oh my, oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. Guys. Wow. I gotta say, I was a little worried about the song because I felt like it wasn't, like from what we saw in the teasers, we didn't get a really good grip on like what it sounded like. So I was a little worried, but that was fantastic. I I love that like the, the sirens in the back of it. Oh my God, I was so distracted by everything going on. I feel like I barely heard the song itself. But what I do remember was really good. Guys, Jacob rapped? Hey guys, I never do voiceovers and I'm trying not to go back and add too many things because that just, that's a lot of work for me. But I had to add a few things that I noticed um, here and there through a voice hours throughout this thing. Um, because when I watched this MV for this, like the literal second time, I noticed so many more things. Um, so I got so excited about Jacob rapping that I completely blacked out Sangyeon rapping here. Also too, probably cause he's crawling on the ground and I was losing my fucking shit about that. But oh my God. And Eric's rap was so long. I was so excited. Um, like, I feel like I, cause Sonu's raps are so good. So of course he gets almost all of the rap lines, but like, that was really awesome to see it like more balanced this time. Also Sonu's like part in the bridge, just fuck, oh my. Oh my god, so good. Also, I know they're two different groups, but this shot with Eric and Sanu with the flashlights just reminded me so much of this clip from um, Sumi Cha, Getting Closer by Seventeen with Dino and Hoshi. I don't know, I got huge flashbacks there. It was so good. News lines, I gotta say, I mean, like, we know that New is like, he's the, he is the vocals of the boys. Like, he's, he's the one that you can hear all the time, um, the, the signature voice. But wow, he just like really fucking brought it. And, New and um, Young Moon in that in the bridge right before it went into the rap that Sunu did. Wow, that was like a beautiful little delicate balance that like had me just on like in a good way, like on the edge of like oh, just like hanging on like what what note are they gonna sing next? Um, I love that Q opened it. I, I did he? Yeah, he was the first one to sing, like besides like the, the main thing. We got so much Juyun center, which is like not surprising because he's almost, he's he's in the center a lot, him and Q, because they're like the like the lead dancers, right? But like, oh my God, what what the fuck kind of water or some something? What, are, Cracker, what are you feeding Juyun <laughs> to make him look that hot? That is so unfair. It's so unfair. And like, I, I have my biases, of course. I'm an Eric bias and like Q's a bias wrecker. And I would, I would literally die for Kevin Moon. I would marry the man. I would die for him. Hi, Kevin. Hi, what is your question? Hi, Kevin. Whatever. Uh, next question, please. Hi, Kevin. Hello, loser. All right, you, way in the back. Hi, Kevin. Hi, Kevin. I'm your biggest fan. But like, when it comes to like, if I'm ranking by like, if I didn't know anything about their personalities, and this is not a dig on them or anything, but like, Juyun is always at the top of the rank because the man is just, look at him. Look at him and tell me that you aren't just obsessed with him. Like, oh my God, the undercut, the like leather shirt, oh. Ooh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna make myself act up if I don't quit it. He's gonna make me act up if I don't, whatever. And the thing is like, I feel like they just get more and more handsome every comeback. And there's always, there's always somebody every comeback that I'm like, how dare they look this good? Cause like, you know, like you think all your, when you, when you stand a group, you're like, of course all the members are handsome, but like you can like keep your eyes like averted for the most part, you're like, I, these are my biases and wow, so-and-so looks really handsome. But then like every fucking comeback they have, they show out somebody with a new haircut or like a new, I don't know, a new wardrobe or just like a new confidence or something. And it just, it fucks me up. Like when it came to DDD, I was like, when did Jacob get so hot? And he still, he like, it still looks great. He looks great here. I love the honey colored hair. But beyond Jacob, when it was the reveal era, I was like, 
Who let Hangyun look this hot? And he still looks hot now, but like, oh my God. Like, what the fuck? And then just like in the in-between times, I gotta say, this is like not with a comeback in particular, but every time I look at Sangyun, I am like, I am in love. I see nobody but you. Who let him be that hot? Who, I mean, here, there was like a very evidence moment of I was like, wow, he looks so good. And then he fucking turns around to the camera and shakes his ass in the camera. <laughs> and looks back at us like, I know you're looking, and I, I but, I mean, you, you watched me. I, I could not handle. I was, <laughs> oh my God, I malfunctioned. It was so good. But, but the point I'm getting to here is that Hyunjae, I know that he's like, he's part of Bermuda Triangle. He's like considered, you know, Mr. Visual with Juyun and Youngun, And I get that, I've acknowledged that, but I've never been, like super into him but oh my oh my god something about what they've got him in style wise maybe it's the hair i don't know i don't know his face just looks amazing right now and that moment when he had the oh my god i have chills oh my god when he had like the the like bulletproof vest on or whatever and he had all the spy lasers on him and then he dropped to his knees and like let his head fall down oh <laughs> <gasps> Bitch, if that wasn't drool worthy in and of itself right there, I don't know what was. Um, y'all, when I tell you, I about fucking screamed. I was literally watching this in my office and I had to stick my fist into my mouth to keep myself from screaming. But I was so distracted by how handsome Hyunjae's face looked that I completely missed that he has like this fucking peekaboo on his pants are you are you fucking goddamn kidding me look at those thighs oh i about had a fucking i i swear to god i was a, like this close to screaming at my desk in front of my co-workers so just in all that me just talking about how hot the members are the styling was fantastic i i felt like when i first saw the teasers the looks were a little bit like not clownish that's not the word i'm looking for but like a little a little heavily stylized where I was like, it's kind of goofy. I'm into it. I, I retract anything I ever thought that was like not, that I was not into it. I'm fully into it now. I loved the little teaser thing they did, the like 11 tips to like, you know, the Steelers, look out for them. These are their tips of like, you know, keep eye contact and like wear perfume. Holy shit, that was so good. And like such a, a good little like drop in there of like, clever promotions, like clever teasers. Really loved that. Um, the neon sets were beautiful. Um, in terms of the dance, like there was so many good moments, but I'm just, I'm overwhelmed and I can't remember <laughs> right now. So I guarantee that by the time they put out like a dance practice or a performance version of this, I'll be ready to talk about my favorite moves. I don't have it in me right now. Also got distracted by Juyun walking, but I'm um, like, hello? Did we see the fucking backflip parkour shit that they had Jacob and Eric do? Like, excuse me? So good? Oh my God. I just know that they looked amazing and we know that they fucking murder the moves. Oh, I do remember one thing. Like, Q like fucking parkoured off a couple people in the very beginning. And I love, we love to see our winners of the Road to Kingdom series. We love to see them using the thing that made them so famous in the first place, which is like their body stunts and stuff. And like, they're like, you know, adapting it down for like not a stage thing. Cause that was like big bombastic and like we're doing it all the time. I love that they're taking elements of that though and putting it into their choreography with that little parkour moment and like swiping out. Oh shit, oh shit. It's so good guys. It's so, it's so good. I know I always am like, I'm gonna have to go watch this again, but I'm, I'm literally gonna have to watch this like four more times to just like be able to see all the things that I wanna see. Cause there's a lot. Oh my God, I love them so much i oh my god guys i i love the boys kevin moon i would die for you please i would die for you love me forever please 